next performer is the mayor of Grand Rapids Comedy. He recently filmed a special in his house that you can watch soon, and he might be able to give you more details. Or if you go to MikeBustler.com, you can find that out. Please put your hands together for Mike Bustler! As soon as Sean said that, I remembered that I forgot to redo my subscription to my website. <laughs> so go to MikeBuster.com tomorrow. <laughs> uh, just over five months over. <laughs> I feel like I'm a bad sober person because I encourage other people to drink and do drugs <laughs> for me. <laughs> like I was, I had like a long, serious, good conversation with my comedian buddy about his gambling addiction and then it somehow turned into talking about heroin. And I was like, you could do heroin a couple times and be fine. <laughs> and he's like, is this what you talk about at AA? And I was like, they don't care for that type of talk. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm becoming toxically positive. <clears throat> it's too much, it's weirding my friends out. For real, this is not like a comedy recently, like today, in the parking lot, today, when I got here, a guy opened up his car door and hit my car, and I was like, but, and then I get out, he like moves, and he can't get out. <clears throat> and then he goes over to the other side of the parking lot, and he, I'm getting out of the car at the same time, he goes, nice job parking, buddy. And then immediately I was like, hey man, it's Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> and then his wife did that whole, like, let's go, let's go. <laughs> that move that, you know, means your marriage is doing well. <laughs> I'm so toxically positive that I meditate at Frederick Meyer Garden. <laughs> I'll tell you, the grandmas and children don't care for a lone adult man. <laughs> when they're looking at the Christmas decorations. I'm kind of annoyed by the point that says, they're in the tropical room. No, no. <laughs> what region of Thailand is that from? The North Pole? I, I go there so much I should know where the point says are from. I don't. Um, I would say that's expert level meditation, though. Don't try it. It takes a lot of focus. And I've been meditating for about 10 years. I don't know if you guys know anything about meditation. This is not very transcendental. <laughs> so, uh, this is going south. I already said the funniest parts about this on the yard. <laughs> they got a quail over it's pretty sick. Um, moving on. <laughs> um, I like to carry around the member, the, they, when you're a member, they give you a magazine that only members can get, and that is like, I let the old ladies see it so they know I'm not just a freak. Um, <laughs> and to let them know that I'm more important than them. I, I ain't no fucking Christmas, whoa, what, and then rocket collar, they call them shoebies. <laughs> uh, you and all that. Yeah, you, it's a show on Nickelodeon. <laughs> I would recommend that you keep drinking. <laughs> if you can stop. That's where it gets dicey. I drank a long time. I, drank, I probably started earlier than most people. I started when I was probably like 14. I'll be honest with you, the first decade is pretty sick. It's, it's, I think a lot of you guys are drinking. You understand? Know, it's fun. The last five years are, it was okay. <laughs> the previous two years, pretty brutal. So um, again, I said the funniest part in the beginning. Because if anybody here is uh, trying to do stand-up comedy, don't do it like this. The funny part's supposed to be at the end. <laughs> so I fixed it there a little bit, but it was difficult. It was <laughs> um, if you are ever confused, on whether or not someone is talking about a rehab, here is a hint for you. <laughs> Every rehab has a direction in the name. 
For instance, if you need to go to rehab here, you're going to call a place called Network 180. They're going to send you to one of two places. It's a turning point or alternative direction. <laughs> so, I want the turning point. <laughs> I'm going to start my own rehab. It's just going to be called Stop. <laughs> does the green light mean that I'm supposed to get off stage, or does it mean that you guys just don't like me? Okay. I, want to know. <laughs> I said, does it mean get off stage? One guy shakes his head, and the other guy goes, yes, it means one man. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.